Welcome to Trucking Tuesday by Race Grooves. Mattel sent me some of their Matchbox Jurassic World models. Here we have the T-Rex trailer. Comes with the T-Rex and uh, a trailer so that you can catch your T-Rex. If you look right here, the cage lifts up, has a little ramp that drops down. Now this is a little bit bigger than the other Matchbox items that they have. I've already showed you this, the T, the 10 Textron Tiger. Thank you for letting me know. That's a real vehicle. Let me show you the size difference. This is a regular Matchbox size model. And when I put it up against that, you see how it's bigger? So it's pretty realistic for it to be a larger vehicle. You got to catch a T-Rex. They also sent me the 14 Mercedes-Benz G550. You probably recognize this from the movie already. This is the same size, a little bit bigger than the Textron Tiger. And let's see what else do we have here. Well, I'm sure you know this. The gyrosphere from the movie. That's where they sit. They go on, the, they get to explore, and they get to run with the dinosaurs. Check it out inside. This thing rolls. So when, when the ball rolls, when the ball rolls, you stay sitting upright. Pretty cool. Let's go ahead and open up the T-Rex trailer. Got my T-Rex. And here is the truck. It has a metal body. This part's plastic. Plastic base. So all this blue part is metal to give it some nice weight. Let's see how the door opens up. Looks like it has a place for you to grip. There you go. That opens up. But I seen on a package, never mind. I, fig I figured it out easy enough. So I guess you get your T Rex and you put them right in there. We'll go down. There you go. You stick it out. And <laughs> look at his tail. Is his tail going to fit? There you go. Got my T Rex. I was looking at his jaw and I see a line right there on his jaw. Can you see that line? Can you see the line around his jaw? I wonder if his I wonder if his mouth opens. Let's see. Oh, that's pretty cool. Another nice detail. That was terrible. That sounded more like a sick cow than a T-Rex. By the way, this does click shut. This way your T-Rex is sealed inside. Let's test the wheels. I'll be quiet. Check the squeaky wheels. No squeaks at all. Fantastic. Nice that it has triple axles. So that means it's a six wheeler. Here you can see the gas tank. Here's the exhaust pipes. You have some headlights in the front. Pretty cool. Hey, be quiet. You might have other toys that you want to play with and put in the cage. Uh, it looks like it's not quite uh, big enough to put in this model. Maybe you'll have other cars that are, that are smaller that will fit in there. Let's see if the gyrosphere fits in there. Oh, that's too big too. I wonder if we can do this. Nah, it's too big. Look, it's, look, it's flaring out right here. So I guess it's best for dinosaurs, or maybe you have other toys that you would like to use it with. That's what they're for. They're toys. Have fun with your toys. That's what I always say. By the way, this isn't the only two-pack that they have. Here's part of my Off the Pegs video at Walmart. This package has a Triceratops. It looks like you can get the T-Rex with two different models. So this way you can pick either one. If you want the T-Rex, you can pick either model or you can get both if you'd like. Check out this pack with the helicopter. Comes with a Raptor. That one's pretty wild too. Thanks to Mattel for sending these for a review. Have fun with your toys. Bye bye. Uh -huh.